to. Back to. I'm from the hood, nigga. I will bag you. Yeah. Back three, back three, back four. Yes, man. It really is me. Me is Zool, aka the instant burner, man. I know a lot of y'all are probably overlooking the offensive settings on this game, or you pretty much just don't know what a lot of them mean because they are in depth compared to 2K16. Well, today I'm gonna show y'all, man, what you should have your your offensive settings on on the park pro am all that, man. Because, bro, they do help you out a lot on this game, bro, compared to 2K16. Like I said, before we get started, I make sure to hit that like. It really is on the channel. But on offense, man, first thing you need to do, man, you need to put your pro stick on absolute. What's, what this means is, you know, when you're in the center of the court and, and left is left, right is right. Well, if you're on the side of the court, left would still be left, right would still be right. So you want to have these settings on absolute. The next thing you want to have, man, <clears throat> as, as your offensive settings, you want to change this, man. Most people just put it on, on openness, but you got to take it a step further, bro. Let me show you what all this means. Pass target direction this pretty much means with your left stick when you're passing the ball how much weight how much do you want it to depend on you pushing in the left the left stick in that direction i would not put this too far the most the most i will put this on bro is 60 to 65 that's if you don't want to put it on 55 like it already is pass target direction this pretty much means bro when, when it comes to when it comes to openness do you want to find the closest guy or do you want to find the skip pass if you want to find the skip pass or the or if some of y'all don't know what that means that means the second or the third pass which would be like if you're on the right side somebody in the in the left corner if you want if you want to find that guy instead of, instead of the screen instead of the roller you will, you will put this up you will put this up to around 80 or something like that but if you're doing pick and roll and you want to find like the cutter the cutter you would you would keep this down around 20 so i would i would not even mess with this but i would keep this around 20 this is a big one right here man pass target openness this pretty much means man do you want to find the open guy how much do you want to wait on on finding the open guy with this man i will put this all the way up to around 80 bro i will put this around 80 so you can find so you don't have to so you can press x and it'll automatically find the open guy for you and, and since you got this on pass target distance it's gonna find the the closest open guy so that that's pretty much it man Th these right here a lot of people don't tell y'all what these mean bro but this is that's pretty much what these three things ring right here man they, they are they are very very important and if, you, if you're not messing with these bro you're pretty much slipping and sleeping but if y'all have any comments or any questions y'all make sure to hit me up in the comment section if you're new please don't forget to subscribe and please don't forget to be a part of the notification gang and share my videos please help me get to 5k and y'all already know who this is it is your boy Mizzle.